guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting right to episode 11 of Wandering Witch. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. There we go. That's better. Be a copycat. <laughs> Suits you. Can you imagine if we had, like, an alternate timeline where she didn't want to become a witch and we just see her in her everyday normal life? The two apprentices. So, Elena and Saya, basically? Because Saya is going to be featured in this episode. She's on her way. Oh, Chris. Because there she is. You feel like, oh, okay. It, sure, Saya, sure. <gasps> and Kitty! She's right. Point in case, right there. Because you're getting distracted. <laughs> mm hmm. Look down. Of course he took something. <laughs> Bye. The hell? Saya? So what in the world did she just actually do? You don't want to open that small box after the shit that happened. Nah, let's not do that. Uh-oh. A boy? No, a girl! <laughs> you honestly look like Rin from Iowa Magic! You're so pretty! 
and called like Ray from Sailor Moon. Well, you know, I'm glad we're finally actually seeing her sister instead of, you know, being having her be talked about and such, you know. <laughs> yeah, cuz No, Saya, you need to wear regular clothes. That's how you're getting spotted. See, Elaine is just seeing the good side of this town. Saya is just seeing the bad side. <laughs> Unless they're in two different, like, towns and cities. But I feel like they're in the exact same place. Damn it. But she's not joking around. Don't open that. Don't open it. You know what that is. No. 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 Uh-uh. <laughs> Damn it. Oh god, is she gonna like... She sure is. <laughs> Um, uh, 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 no, 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 no.
this isn't happening. What the fuck? Please get her somewhere safe, please. <laughs> and find Saya as you. Oh my god. <laughs> Yeah, there she is. Yeah, that's you, but Saya. I honestly cannot wait to see how the dub does this episode. <laughs> You're the one who opened the chest! Yeah, could you open that chest? Worry about you two first. Well, Elena over here opened it. And your sister went nuts. Uh huh. Mia, Mina, Mina. Yeah, she got like, y yeah. Mm -hmm. You don't want to know what happened. Uh huh. Sorry, Elena scares me. I mean, Elena, Saya, like, mm. Elena, Saya is just chill, like always, because that is natural Elena. But Saya in Elena's body, like, <laughs> please. No, that one, like, excuse me, that one fake witch switched you through those ball things at you. What he said.
It's so weird to see Elena in Saya's body acting badass. Well, because normally when she's in her own body, you know, she a badass witch. But <laughs> and Saya's the one who's just like, you know, <laughs> clumsy. This is just this witch getting her revenge about what happened last week. can't do it right away. Yeah. Those two are so confused. I need them to just explain everything. Because she punched him. Like, in the stomach. and the gu Really in the gut. Oh, thank God. Oh. Maybe you just need to wake her up. <laughs> but yeah, you lean aside and punched your sister in the gun. <laughs> No, it was that lady throwing the red and blue ball. Oh, well, damn, Sheila. Mm -mm. Well, you're right about that, but... <laughs> mm-hmm. 
Yeah. It just basically tells you that, like, Saya and Mina kind of have separation anxiety because they haven't seen each other in, like, how long? It's been, like, a couple of years. Oh. <laughs> You don't want to know. Yeah. Uh. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Poor Saya. <laughs> So fun, Sensei, what are you going to do? Well, I did. Okay, your mom or your grandma, but I think it's her mom. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. Go see your family. You haven't seen them in a while. This was a cute episode, honestly. I mean, this was just part two to part of last week's part one. But, I mean, I love the fact that, you know, Fun says it is like, you need to kind of go home and you need to see your family because she's been traveling for a couple of years now. So, I mean, yeah, they, she hasn't really, we haven't seen her family since like episode two, maybe three. And such. So, I mean, I, I get it. It would make the most sense if they have the last episode of this series for her to go home and just, like, kind of be with her family for, like, maybe the first half of the episode and the second half of the episode she leaves and she travels somewhere else. I mean, so, it would be nice. This was a really good episode. Honestly, and I can't... This felt really like the last episode. I don't know. I mean, even though we're not done with this show, I would love, 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 love love for this show to get a season two. It's really good. I can't 
imagine how they're going to really wrap up everything for next week and to see what Elena's final adventure is going to be for us but really if it does get a chance to have a season two I think they'll probably take it in like a heartbeat it, like I've always said it depends on the merch I always think uh, like American um it's about ratings and stuff it's not it's a completely different country where it's about merch and so i think maybe because of the fact is with the darker episodes of this series probably between the little girl who was the murderer and um lynn the princess lynn killing off her dad um and then the brother sister flower thing and then the other episode with that episode I think probably a lot of people want to get the books for that and then also to learn about the relationship of friends and say any land of themselves because I remember somebody saying like in episode one or episode two that they're somewhat in a relationship but not really and that could be like something that that possibly interests people I really am interested in it because I want to know what's going to happen next with her what are like the dark twisted things that she's going to get into what are the sad things that she's going to get into what is she going to see next where is she going to go next I mean even if they wanted to do like an hour long OVA, a freaking movie with this series or even a season two, that's something that I really want them to purposely do. But we'll talk more about that going into the last episode next week. But still, this is a really cute and sweet episode concluding part one and part two, emerging into the, together. Mina, she's adorable. And now actually learning about the fact is that... Yeah, in a way, Mia and Saya, they have that separation anxiety, but it's okay. Everybody has that. It was cute. They're so cute. Honestly. If this series doesn't end with, like, Saya and Elena getting married, I will, like, freaking explode. <laughs> Even though Elena's like, no, I don't want to get I want it to happen, but other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of Wandering Witch. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially, y'all, next Friday for the final episode. Bye, guys!